All right, Coach J, Leap Zone Strategies here on Friday. Fun Friday. And I just got off some work, but it was fun work, so I wanted to share. <laughs> I wanted to share. I was actually just in uh, uh, with a client just now in Nanaimo. I've been here for uh, three hours. Uh, and it's, a, it's a, a local business that has a team of employees. And so this week I, I had time to kind of go in and have meetings with the team members and really uh, get to know uh, get to know the ins and outs of the squad that each individual persona makes up the whole and makes up an effective and uh, you know uh, straight line thinking momentum focus point towards business success. And what what I enjoyed today, though, honestly, is that first it, it's great in terms of uh, getting in back into that team environment. I mean, we do have. Uh, larger companies that we coach with Leap Zone Strategies and predominantly we deal with entrepreneurs and solopreneurs. So it's nice to for me to dive in back into that teamwork arena, which I know so well and I love. And it just reminds me that at the end of the day, the secret of your success as a business owner is truly the people who are your front line. And it amazes me how over the years I've been working for big companies and running companies and yet owners very rarely understand and see their employees. They very rarely truly understand and they truly see their employees and how each employee is an is their own entity and understanding that own entity truly can really elevate their business and on the flip side how important and how rewarding it is to to have employees feel heard and and feel seen and and, and that's what I love about the work we do at Leap Zone is we are heart led and we and we are very intuitive and, and so when you when you let when you let the heart lead energetically, you're you're quite open to to reception and, and it's like I I can kind of feel and read people instinctively and and so I'm able to really get in to to resonate with them. And it's really re rewarding, and it's rewarding for them. And to see, even today, right, for, for three hours, I had uh, six appointments. And it's it's interesting because, like clockwork, right, they, they come in kind of timid and not sure what to expect, and, you know, here's this high-performance business coach coming in and, and then within a couple minutes, you know, as you, you, you read the energy, you flow in conversation with them and you listen. You actively listen to not only what they're saying, but to what their energy is saying. And every, every interview I had today, by the end of the session, it was, you know, they, they were alive. They felt like they, they, they could, they had somebody that truly understood them. And so my point is, is that, you know, whether you are a business owner, in this case, uh, you know, someone who has a team, taking the time to invest in your team is one of the most important things you can do. On a personal level, taking time to invest in your own team, in your own circles of influence, as I like to call it, is, is super important. I think we all truly want to be seen and truly understood. Whatever that means to each of us and to each of you out there, that's a powerful thing, whether it's in a relationship um, with a loved one, right? And I think the more powerful those love relationships are, 
it's because they they get they get us right they get me they see me they understand me um and our close-knit friends friends that i have you know some of you a few of you are watching from back <laughs> back in the roadie days um but those friends get me i don't i can show up and they get me i don't have to tiptoe around i don't have to kind of rekindle certain things and in the job front it's the same imagine how how a front line of employees would be efficient efficiency wise if they truly felt that their owner got them it's the same right it's, it's a fucking powerful thing so fun friday for me was was actually working and you know that i always try to bring fun i don't try i always make a point to bring fun into the workplace with me and it was just a really rewarding great flow friday flow end of the week for me um, inspiring um, a bunch of people that you know a few hours ago didn't even know who i was that is what lights me on fire uh, as a person and as a performance coach and somebody who just wants to elevate the human condition. So, with that, gang, kicking off long weekend here in Canada. I still have a hard time wrapping my head around that it's Thanksgiving in Canada, and then Thanksgiving for me is still in November, but you'd think after 13 years here I would get used to it. I haven't. So, <laughs> anyway, um, it's a long weekend here in Canada. Happy Thanksgiving to all my Canada folks and for everyone back in Rhodey. Uh, I will say the same in one month's time. <laughs> All right. Cheers, gang.